Police are investigating a murder after a man was found dead in a home near ODU on West 42nd Street. Investigators got to the home around 8 o'clock last night. The 58-year-old man was dead when officers arrived. Tonight, his roommate, who found him, talked to Janu Her about the gruesome scene. Norfolk police say they found that man's body in this house right here near ODU tonight. It's relatively quiet, but in the backyard, you can still see police tape from the investigation. Running on just about an hour of sleep, Najib Najjar is trying to remember the last time he saw his roommate. I, I see him on December 26 or something like that, around that, that estimated date. Between Christmas and New Year's, Najjar figured his roommate was just visiting family. But on Wednesday night, after he got home from the ODU library, Najjar says the man's family came looking for him. Najjar checked the man's room once, but when the family insisted they check for themselves, Najjar followed. They opened the door, turned on the lights, and he says that's when they found the man, dead, underneath blankets. Najjar called police. What really messed me up was when he curled up and there was like blood on the floor and, I don't know, some type of... It was too difficult to know if what kind of wound it was, if it was cut wounds or because it was just so much blood on the on the actual wound itself. Police say they responded just before nine o'clock Wednesday night and the man was dead when they got there. Najjar says they don't know who killed their roommate, but he was recently receiving death threats and someone threw a concrete block through their window. A few weeks ago, he says someone even wrote 187 on their front door, the California state penal code for murder. Every time I try to sleep, I would like uh, I would definitely, like, I would think about the way his body was curled up. I don't know, that's the worst part to me right now, other than the fact that, you know, his family members had to see that too. In Norfolk, Chinuher, 13 News Now.